So hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Asi Dalin, aka Asi of Canada. Thank you guys so much for clicking once again. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. And to all my OGs, you know what to do. Comment down below. Let me know, gang, gang. If you've missed any of our vlogs, please catch up. Because on today's video, I'm going to be sharing the raw feeling, the raw experience of studying here in Canada as an international student. And especially for those of us that are plus 30s, you know, this is basically adult education. Everything on this video is my raw experience sit back relax and enjoy please make sure to like subscribe and share the video see you guys my name is asitonka agri abba and channel is called asi darling because i'm such a damn <laughs> guys just found out that i have another assignment that is due before 12 today i have no idea about the course like this this thing i'm telling you guys is real I'm not a dull student, do you get? I know that the fact that I arrived about three weeks after school had started, started, and then I needed a week to put things together and all of that. And the fact that these are new programming languages. But this pattern of learning, I'm not going to lie to you guys, is absolutely frustrating. It's frustrating. This pattern of learning is not it at all. We, it almost seems like we are... We are we are teaching ourselves. You get assignments upon assignments. And yes, my grades are okay. But still, I don't think I'm getting value yet. Okay. It's too quick to judge because I think we're about a month in. Because school started ninth. Um, I think my own class started by, by on the 12th or something like that. So yesterday or the before yesterday would have made it one month. So it's, it's still early. Okay. But seriously... I'm about to mail the professor to ask for extension because there's no there's no mass I want to solve to understand this thing. There's no mass. There is no mass. I don't want I don't want a situation whereby it just seems like I'm going to look for how to copy it or I don't know. I don't know. And then guess what? I also found out that she had a quiz that was due yesterday. The same yesterday that I was dying to finish that other one. I had one quiz that I did not know of. Like I did not know. I don't even know if my other classmates knew because I had asked. I was like, do we have any other assignment? Do you? And everybody was mentioning that main one. I don't know if people remember this or forgot because seriously, I was so stressed. Um, like, I'm, I know my main light isn't on. This light is enough for me because we're using the system. Um, yesterday, I was so stressed. I think, what's the time now? This is like 10, this is like 11. I was awake 12, 1. I was calling people in Nigeria, like, because I knew it was around, what, 6 o'clock, 6, 7. I just needed to speak with someone. I slept so late. It's not like I want. I wanted something new, but I just needed to talk to because I was so mentally stressed. And it's looking like this today, so I'll be stressed. Because yesterday, my stress was so high. Like, it had pent up and... Even after sending a lecture and mail that I was going to need extension, I finally met up the deadline. This one too, I have to also send a mail. It's stressful. It's like, I don't know. I really don't know. This is raw. This is real. I don't know, guys. So, um, that's what I, 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 I was also telling one of my friends. I said, I've not really gotten a fit, like, in terms of the, the lectures yet. Because it just seems like I'm going from assignment to assignment. Like, what is even that? I'm just doing assignments. Like, I've, no, I've not gotten the gist of the whole thing. So, um, what I will do is, this assignment or not, I will apply for extension and see what I can do tomorrow. I do not have, I do not have, like, I don't think I, I, I'm i going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Tomorrow is Valentine. Not tomorrow. Oh, yeah, it's still tomorrow. Tomorrow is Valentine because it's just 10.54. Um, tomorrow is Valentine. I want to finish editing one video because the truth is right now i'm not working and i'm not actively looking for a job seriously i don't even like the people right now i'm so stressed i'm so stressed i just need somebody to tell me to calm down yes. it's well that's one thing about living if in a different place eh? it's not like you don't know that like now i'm just 13 days like two weeks you get two weeks by right, I've achieved a lot. In fact, somebody came in and was looking for a house today and looked at us and was like, ah, you will look like you'll be here for three months. I said, no, two weeks. Like, I'm not, I don't know. But still at the back of my mind, there's this um, performance anxiety 
or just this this anxiety of you need to you need to perform you need to move you need to move it's a lot i've done a lot of youtube videos i've posted a lot of videos you would have even been surprised like my videos were going back to back back to back the only difference is that you will not have been seeing my face and then by now if you're watching this you already know the reason um because the internet here is very good all i need to do is to just edit the video five ten minutes that is because the video is very long that's when it takes that minutes when i was in my airbnb two minutes three minutes pff, speed like it just uploads so you can finish editing upload do thumbnail leave that one to be doing well be editing the next one you can edit videos and arrange it to upload like arrange like four videos then you go about your your daily routine and all of that but anyways guys so that's why i just wanted to rant about my plan is to start reading from week one for every course from week one so what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be starting with the course that we have um not tomorrow is tuesday wednesday courses i'll start with wednesday courses to read it so that before the actual course i've like i've gotten the gist of the course okay that's basically it so help me god this is just my plan anyway guys so this is just a mini rant i don't know if i'm going to add this part but let me get back to reading i was thinking i'll sleep early today but looking like 11 o'clock i know I'm not yet ready to sleep. Right. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Happy Valentine's Day. Today is Valentine's Day. Um, I decided to just come to the kitchen to um get some to heat up my rice and then get the coffee, my coffee, and take it upstairs because today is going to be a reading day. I love this one. Like, I'll just stand here because seriously, I've been needing some. <laughs> 12 30 here and um it's about 6 30 in nigeria so i usually stay awake because micah is going to school i have to speak with you <laughs> are you enjoying your bread yes <laughs> micah is say a sweet boy Good morning, guys. So today is February 15th, the day after Valentine's. I'm sure that some of you have finished preparing all of us, but then whatever. <laughs> okay, so today I have a video to do. Um, I'm going to be doing that um, voiceover video for post-Valentine, Wahala. And um, I have a class in a couple of minutes. So what I want to do, I just came to take orange juice. I'll take bread. Probably after my class, I'll eat upstairs. But I have to edit that video and put up. Whew, finally, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit more relaxed because yesterday I was able to get um, up to date with the course I'm going to be having now. Um, that's the first one. I have five more to go. I have a couple of assignments due this week. So what I'll do is after this class, I'll focus on assignments and then I will now resume maybe the course I have tomorrow morning, you know, just from beginning to end because I need to be... I need to be in the know. If not, this school is just, it's just going to be hanging in the air and I don't like that kind of feeling. Anyways, hope you guys are fine. I'm just going to be taking this thing like back to back vlogs. It might just be a compilation. I don't know how many days I'm going to put into one day, especially after the first week. After the first seven days, the rest of them is just vlogs. And the reason I'm putting my day is just so that I have a mental time stamp of what was happening at um, um, each particular day, what was, what was going on um, each day. The snow is melting. Snow is melting. I think it will snow again. I do not believe this is the end of winter because we are just in February 15th. Let me show you guys outside. Amen. 12.30 now. Um, 12.30 a.m. Today is Thursday. And um, yeah, I'm listening to winners of prayer. I still have um, assignments. Man, schoolwork is kicking my ass. Like, let me flip this corner. It's not easy. Like, since I landed, the only thing is the first two weeks, I just ignored class because I needed to settle down. Now that I've settled down, I'm playing catch up. I'm playing catch up because there was no way I would even be serious with school if I did not. If I didn't get this sorted. Next week is test, so I can't sleep. I have to read. I have assignments. I have group projects. After this group one, I have another one. So.
So hopefully, man, it's a lot, but God will help us. You guys are fine. Uh, the good thing is I'm already used to um, staying awake in the night from Nigeria, so I'm okay. And then I've spoken, my son is still sleeping. Today is, um, what's this thing? Open day, so he's not going to school early. So I'll call him back. This is like 6.30 Nigerian time, so... Let me continue reading. All right, guys. So today is 16th and pretty much the snow is melted. Everything is gone. Everything is gone. So, yep. Today is still 16th, I guess. Yes, 16th of February. I'm going to be wearing makeup for the first time since I came. I'm wearing this Zaron, Zaron powder in brownie. I got this plug from Adese Space when I went to shoot um, our when I went to shoot our, our collabo video for her reality check. I just went to my face like this and I was like, ah, ah. when I saw the setup, I just thought Adese helped me with makeup powder, so she just brought this and the coverage was really nice. So I decided to go and buy it. So that's the brownie set. Just use it. Hopefully my color hasn't changed though because hey, it's a worry. I know that I, I I suspect I got a bit lighter. I suspect. What do you think about the coverage? This is my first time seeing my face with powder. <laughs> For a long time I've been on my skincare game. So see my face looking a bit this powder. I have, still don't mind me, I have foundation but I beg it's not that deep. It's just a 45 seconds video and I don't want a station whereby I didn't put in my best. So that's why I'm not wearing for any foundation for that this thing, I beg. I'll start wearing foundation when I want to do my sit down videos and hopefully the soon. Because I've just been trying to be consistent. I also have to start posting on my other channel. Because that's why I want to put my Canada content. I've thought about it long and hard. And I feel like I should just have the two channels. This one will still be doing what it's doing. And I will still be covering celebrity topics and all of that. Then the other one, I focus on my Canada journey and my life here. What I'm doing and all of that, so just so that it doesn't clash. With the grace of God, that channel will grow. I think now we are just at one k something, so hopefully we grow. Yeah, so. Just powder. No, I'm not putting a brow pencil back. And then my normal navy. I got these glasses from my younger sister, so, so if I came, I think this is nice. So, should I push the hair back? Yeah, I think I should push the hair back. It's, it's I'm supposed to dress corporate, but I don't have any corporate, whatever. It's just a class presentation, it's not. After all, Steve Jobs was wearing turtleneck, so. My black turtle leg was among the things I washed today. So should I use this? Or I should use this. I think this this is giving timidity vibes. This is giving I'm not sure of myself. This this is giving I don't give two F's. I'm going to do this presentation because I know I'll kill it. I think I'll use this. I think I'm done. Let me go and do my presentation. Hope you guys are fine. All right, let's go. Let's switch off the lights in this bathroom, sir. Which part of this room, sir? It's like it's that bathroom that is bright. Although I said I should do it. Seated. Okay. Let me keep these things on top here. I'll try to adjust the leg of this thing. 
do it seated like this. Take this up. Take it up like this, and I'll do the presentation like this. Hi, so welcome. I think this box will go, but having this water, water should go down. My frap a bit cooked that I put in my frap, but <laughs> should go on. Okay, what do you think of the setup now? Um, Alright, I think I'm good to go. Let me just um, confirm with my group. Hi, my name is Asitonka Agri Abba. Together with my group members, Michael and Ria, we represent Group 9. Today, we are going to be introducing our data set gotten from the Toronto Police, and it's going to be highlighting all shooting related incidents that happened from January 1st, 2004 to June 30th, 2022. This data set is very important as it highlights the top 10 neighborhoods with the most fatal shooting occurrences as well as the time of day that these kind of shootings often occur. This data set is also going to be useful for real estate agents, new home buyers, the Toronto police that would like to analyze the data to be sure of the areas in Toronto that need more public intervention. Thank you so much for listening and this has been the presentation for Group 9. Alright guys, so I'm done with my um, presentation. Went well. Just a 45 seconds video and because I already have um experience with video editing i just told them i'll do it i'll do it i just went to cha 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 i did that it put it up and they're like yay i'd like to say no more <laughs> anyways i want to take out my makeup a bit let me go back to factory setting and um, just another group assignment we had um that was due eight o'clock just at the nick of time we finished our um, this one is due um 12 a.m I think the time is um yeah time is 15 minutes to nine now so we've already we're concluding it to do i've submitted the video that's to represent everything that all of us are doing this night itself i, I would not sleep i don't think i'll sleep because i have to read there are many courses i've not like started following and next week is next week is exam mm -hmm. not exam like midterm whatever the people are fine so this is what I've been going through all the period that um, those that watch my other channel, of course. I'm sure most of you please will check out my other channel, Acidali. So from the other channel, you see this period. I was always trying to be consistent. I was posting like every day. So far, your girl is just meeting deadlines. I've not really, I've not gotten to the point where I can say aha, especially because of school. Hopefully, God will help me. That's just my prayer. And then um, another thing, sure, I was telling you guys. Like this part of my space, this part of my house, yeah, I can put like a couch or a chair or something. Hopefully when people are doing spring cleaning, I get to find something that from thrift store or something that I can put here. But I'm going to watch out for bed box because anything furniture, I'm trying to buy the main ones that will be in this house brand new. I've not thrifted anything yet. So if I get like a chair here, I want to use here for my studio space. I have to get potted plant, open this window, get the other strip colored light. This my phone should serve. Um, I was looking to buy a mic, man. I saw those uh, DJI mic. I should have just bought the road video micro when I was so not video micro, the wireless mic. I should have just bought it when I was in um, Nigeria. Now I saw it 400 and waiting dollars. My head was like, ah, 400 and something. You know, when I'm in Nigeria, I just want to buy it and probably they will say 200 and something here. I'll be like, eh, just buy it. But this time now everything is just doing me cost cost. <laughs> the time is like 3.22. Like 3.22. No phone. Talking with Johnny. I've spoken with Mom C. Spoken with Soso. See writing, doing assignments. Weather condition is like minus 3. And it's snowing. So maybe tomorrow. Because today the place was just um, clear. Tomorrow my wake up to white everywhere again i was telling zodi that this this winter is not over good morning guys so <laughs> after weather was showing heavy snow see the light thing that is falling here maybe it's this morning that the heavy one will fall sure but they are just flurries and then the ground is getting white again okay, the so you can just open that room so this is a super store data set Okay, Hi guys, so, so 
And this is the B plus. I'm in class today, 16th. I just, um, I think 30 minutes ago, I just uploaded the Messi Aigbe video. So, if you look at this, this is the Yeah, <laughs> just checking to make sure that the mom meets. Sorry for the echo, I'm still in the bathroom. I, I mean, class, I have this class, I have another class, but. Man, today is so cold. You know what used to do? Whenever I'm indoors, I'll just wear my light PJs and I keep feeling cold. I'll be like, ah, yes, the heat that works, so but ah, yesterday's cold. And I said, ah, top. Maybe that's why they used to wear hoodie inside. I was thinking I'm still in Ninja. I beg, today I wore hoodie because temperature is so done. Today's my new seven. I don't know if you're seeing it. Today's my new seven. When I use edge controller, it gets white easily. This edge controller. You know how you will be feeling like, oh, when I come here, I'll form my hair, I'll be doing. Since the hair has been like this, and um, today is what, 17th? I mean, in the next two weeks or one week, I'll take it out because I don't have strength. I've just been packing it. It's stressful for me. I'll take it out. Thankfully, Zodi can do all back. But also, another thing, uh, the reason why I've been today is because you know those other weeks, I've, they are like this because of packaging things. And I may need to put it on somebody's head, start, you know. And I don't have strength. So basically, that's it. Class is going on. Let me just. I need to go to the kitchen and get food first. I'll take this with me. When I get the food, I'll come back up to listen to the class. Alright, guys, so the time is 11 30 today, February 16th. And um, yeah, it's a lot. I finished my last class and um, I went up. I was reading. I'm getting so cold. I decided to come down and make coffee. When I was leaving Nigeria, <laughs> there's nothing I didn't carry. I carried this Nesca 3 one. So I'm just going to make two and put in my um, bottle, take it up. Um, this year, I've been under a tremendous amount of stress. I really, I'm really grateful for the kind of friends I have, the family. When I'm just tired, I'll just be calling, calling and see a uh, shout out to them because matter the number of times i call in a day it's almost like we spoke today i'm still calling you back i'm still calling you back it's not easy and that speaking to my friends is my own therapy okay um i checked my bill my network provider and i'm supposed to pay my bill before the 20th i have four days and the thing is it's only accepting credit card i've applied for credit card in fact the first day i applied for my bank account i applied for credit card and they have not answered me so tomorrow morning that's the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to call the help center if they cannot sort it out um i'm out of orange juice and what coke so i might have to go out and if they can't sort it out probably need to go to the mall so i can check bail at the mall or i call the bank i'm sure they'll be able to sort it out one way or the other so that i can pay that bill because i guess it's doing credit score credit whatever um yeah so yeah either that or i'll just go to the bank i have an assignment that is due in 24 hours that's the course i'm reading now we have a couple of courses i'm doing six courses this semester it is a lot six all of them have one assignment or the other that they are demanding from me and at this point they i'm just hanging on i'm just hanging on so hope you guys are fine this will just be like my daily vlog slash rant or whatever but i'm doing well thank glory be to god so far so good i'm doing well it's about 11 p.m i'm still going to be up till one or two or three it depends um yeah that's basically it guys i know i'm not shooting this in real time but pray for me i'm stressed I'm stressed you have me from trying to be consistent on youtube is even by god's grace like if i sleep i wake up usually by 9 10 because i sleep very late when I wake up, I just try to stretch, make some calls, 
and the moment she left when I jumped down and tried to start editing video that will be up by one shoot edit arrange everything before I can do any other thing I'm just try my best guys I'm trying my best so anyways let me continue reading so this will be the end of this one's this other vlog tomorrow we'll shoot again Time now is 4 a.m. Today is Saturday, 18th of um, February. Checking my group chat. I just closed this um, computer. I finished my test. It's crazy. So next week I have. Okay, I just finished the quiz. I have this assignment. This assignment. This test next week. And at this point, I am just so exhausted. I want to lie down and sleep. And um, tomorrow. I would um, do my life and the things I planned at this rate. May God just help me. I don't want to break down because I can't even afford to break down. But I'm just hoping on God. And I seriously want to thank you guys. I don't know when this, when you watch this, as soon as I get over this test week, um, I will now be able to start augmenting the two. Um, hopefully, I'm planning to start dropping com content canada content from first march that has been the plan so i might be able to work on on that plan but crossing my fingers hope everything is going to be fine and um yeah good night or good morning see you guys hi guys so this is another morning today is the 18th and i spoke to you guys earlier i think few hours ago but i woke up first i woke up by seven I don't even know who woke me, one of those my apps. And then I slept back, I woke up by 10, rested a bit, I've shot a video, out. I've not edited it. But the time is like past one, and I said I was going to go on live, my first live. I'm going to go on live by 8 o'clock Nigerian time, which is 2 o'clock our own time. So I just want to get ready, prep, and I'll be going on live in Zodi's room, because I feel it's the basement, and it's not project as much sound, because here it's just... The entire house is echo, 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 and I don't want to disturb, so I'll go to the basement and uh, so this room to do the live. And then, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. But hope you guys are fine. Man, <laughs> I don't even know how to explain my stress now. It's just that I'm, I'm just trusting God, sure. You know, I was able to finish the assignment and submit also the quiz, so that's it. I heard that they have public holiday on Monday. Um, it doesn't make any difference for me because usually I do not have classes on Monday, so that's okay. But if I go out later this evening, I might go to Walmart because I have a couple of things I need. Hope you people are fine. Now. Oof! Hey, Magic. Hey. Where are you? Yeah, you too. In your local dialect, yeah? What's the word that is used when people want to shout like exclamation for anything? I know that mostly Okrika is Yayo. Unless we have another one, I can't remember. But Yayo is so nice. It's like um, Omo. I think Omo is Yoruba. Omo, eh? Uh -huh. Yayo. You're telling somebody one story that the thing is entering and they're like, yeah, you. Hey, you know. Uh, yeah, you too, as in, <laughs> that one is, even if a thief is running on it, yeah, I'm bad or something. Or you lost something. Actually, those are the ones they use. I've not been doing that before. It doesn't stop me from actually taking my skincare and the likes very serious. Just I, it elevates my mood because there's really nothing else I'm doing in this house. Just bed, get ready, sit down, and um, do your assignments and all of that. So I have some journals and documents to read. Today I'll do SAS programming. I'll try to finish all the workshops. Thankfully, the exam I have six courses, but I think it's only three that are doing tests. So. Hopefully I'm able to, yesterday I finished the, what's the woman's course? Data visualization. Yesterday I finished everything on data. 
But the catch is, I'm not actually putting on my camera, so <laughs> you've already set up. I'm not putting on my camera for this filming, and I'm, I'm just happy to be gisting with my people. Like, I, I don't know if I tell you guys how much you mean to me. Like, YouTubers, when you connect with your audience, like me, I really connect with my audience, you almost feel like you know them. So it's almost like I need to catch up with my people, I need to catch up with my people. I was supposed to post a video today, but I was like, no, let's gist. I want gist. I want to feel vibrant again. And then, yeah, that's one of the ways I've been able to deal with any form of homesickness or anything. Like, I'm always, always calling my people. I'm calling home. I'm calling my car. I'm speaking with my friends. I'm speaking with my parents. I'm speaking. Like, I'm speaking with somebody. Even if I'll just put on the camera, you'll be doing your work. I'll be doing my work. Let's just, you know, and it has helped a, a whole lot. So, let me go downstairs. Let's get ready for the life. All right, so I've set the place to go and do my life. I've not eaten no, because I slept by four and woke up late. So I'm not hungry. That's why I need to go out after this live stream to go and get my juice and coke and liquid. Because if I have liquid, I won't even be bothered. It's not different from Nigeria, because even in Nigeria, not today eat. So I was... <laughs> Okay, but I have a gusisha. Maybe after the life or before the life. Let me even arrange my life. Maybe I will just go gather. That sounds like a plan. <laughs> All right, so I'm done with my live stream. Just cleared up. We're going to one Chinese store to get the um, groceries. Mm. Oh, they huh. First things I moved in. We are going out today. I just finished that life. Right now, the time is to six. Have a few minutes. We need to catch up with the boss. She's <laughs> It's like I'm. Uh, oh, yes, buy. I bought from Walmart. I just went and bought more three. Yeah, I brought from Nigeria, but I bought more. So, did not make me fall off. Let's <laughs> convince. Fresh clementines, mandarin, red plum, sweet plum, donut peach. Joy of a rivers girl to come to a strange land and see fish. <laughs> Happiness. Let me show you. Food. There's joy in my soul. I'm seeing lots of fish, guys. There's white knee fish, see tilapia. Nothing will stop me from from doing native soup. There's tilapia. There's pickle. See see white bass. Like I perceive. Wow, so much fish. Hey, hey. We tilapia fillet, fresh big head, red grouper. Wow, fresh salmon, sea shark. Those of you that want to eat shark, sea crab, 
crab the, uh, the ones in the in the district. Wow. See the crabs and clam. Uh, 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 no, 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 this is it's not their own type. It's not like our own. It's not our own. Hey, see the way the beef is. Hey, see the real beef. Eight pounds. They just cut it for you. Okay. Soup don't settle. Soup, soup don't settle. See, see chicken feet. Chicken feet for those that want chicken feet. Boneless pork belly. Guys, this place is really big and nice. So this one month anniversary, she's bringing me to, to this Chinese spot. Makes a lot of sense. I love it. I love it. Don't be saying that. You know she 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 she's adventurous. She has been moving around. Oh my my! How did you even find it? I really don't know. <laughs> so that hunger. Oh okay. See this area they have pastry. Yes. Milk. See, uh, I've not even I've not gotten used to this Canadian liquid milk matter. I've been here for like two weeks plus. But that liquid milk is invasion of privacy. For you to come and tell me my milk to water ratio, we should even date. Uh, we should cook date because that one is just that one is too private. In fact, if after that kind of information, I should give you my bank account. Uh -uh, what kind of problem is that? I also have this their corner for their noodles, bread, the buns. You even have a seafood fried rice, six dollars. Stir food, seven dollars. Curry chicken. Are you serious? Nice. I think these are all that are left. This should be the leftovers. Which one is that? It's pasta. Have you Pops. tried it before? I've eaten this kind, but not here. I think they have a place where they do all this buba tea. Oh, juices. Nice. Love it, love it. Ha ha ha, need to. Hundred dollars for this biggest one. Guys, you should see me go. Full cream, ninety nine dollars. So it's sixty five. Wow. This is so did I carry coffee from Nigeria? Three in one, next cup, one whole roll. <laughs> not, not till I know. I thought this thing through. Every single step. I'll see this cute bottle series. <laughs> tiny, tiny ones. Nice. But I've come. I've picked up cook. Let me go and pick others. It's corn drink. Kind of thing is corn drink. Fun Indomie! Yay! This one is barbecue chicken flavor. And this one is hot and spicy. Nice! In the place is cold though. This one is like standing outside without the wind. Yeah. Um, Zod is looking for oats for breakfast. Um, ew, you see this um, peanuts? See these are peanuts. Guys, you remember? It's here. Yeah. It's normal. Cocaine peanuts. It's late though. Oh. We just finished. We are going back home. So. Place is cold or oh, where a driver, I don't know. He has arrived, no even know where they go. Let me stream. Today is officially 20th of February. So I've been awake two, three. This week is um exam week. I think this particular bonnet, the black one is a bit tight, so I don't like bringing it front. I'll take it back a bit. But I can sleep. Hope you guys are fine. I need to take my drugs. I'm tired. I'm seriously tired. Um, I have assignments due tomorrow. This course I'm reading. I'm almost done with the slides, so tomorrow I'll start the coding, thankfully, and hopefully I'll be able to submit those assignments. And I don't know, I'll start reading for the other ones that I'm going to be having. Hopefully, I come up with a proper plan for this test because I look forward to it. But anyways, we'll be done and sleep. Bye, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah.